The Electoral Commission of Ghana has commenced the registration of new voters ahead of December 7th. This exercise in accordance with Article 45 of the 1992 Constitution takes place at the 266 district offices of the Commission, a departure from the previous system where limited registration occurred at electoral areas. The 21-day registration period allows Ghanaians who turned 18 years old since the last registration in 2022 as well as those who missed the previous exercise to register. Eligible voters can use either the Ghana card or the passport for identification. In the absence of these documents, applicants can only present two registered voters to vouch for their citizenship and age. The EC initially estimated 1.35 million registrants but revised to it approximately 800,000. Some political parties expressed concerns about holding the registration only at the district offices, fearing that voters in remote communities might be disenfranchised. However, the EC remains committed to ensuring a credible and inclusive process. In an interview with the district electoral officer for Ashedu Keteke here in Accra, Mr. Eric Bued the author said this to Adwa News. At the end of the 21 days, the expectation is that we should be able to register any qualified person that comes to the registration center. I cannot give you an exact figure that we maybe we are expecting to register about 4,000 or 5,000. But at the end of the, at the, end of the uh, uh, 21 days, anybody who uh, came to the center qualified should be registered without any challenges. Though is a volatile area, we are we have not experienced any uh, let's say since that will call for uh, people to be asking what is happening. Normally there are some little little uh, disagreements and those things are we say they are normal. Well since the day one uh, I'm sure you have followed through. The day one, we had challenges with the, the internet connection where registration was slowed down for some time. Second day, we were able to register. Then we had some little challenges. But for now, I can tell you that the, the system is uh, good and uh, registration is ongoing. Uh, from the previous days, what we realized is that anybody who has come here, either uh, we are able to register the person, unless, of course, the person did not come here on time because we start at 7 and we close at 6 p.m. Do you have any final comments? Oh, what our advice is that we we will suggest to parents and even all Ghanaians that for their children who are coming to register, they should first of all uh, cross-check and make sure that the people are qualified in terms of age they should be 18 years or above because we don't want to have the challenge where somebody will come here below 18 and yet the people would want him to register when you do that it doesn't give the integrity of the voters register that we as electoral commission we are wishing for then secondly to i would also uh, advise that this register that we are putting together is for Ghana. So if you are a foreigner, you should desist. That one, we have made it strongly that if you come and we, are, we have the evidence that you are not a Ghanaian and you want to register, the law will take its course. So we would advise people who are not Ghanaians to stay away from this registration side because we are not doing it for foreigners. I think if they adhere to this, we'll have a peaceful uh, registration.